292 two out of summer jam is finally here. I have it, it, they're not special, they're not just special. They're family. Yeah. Bryce yeah. movement. K Town in the house. And, yeah. not, and by the way, not K Town as in Kearns, yeah, the yeah. original K Town, Koreatown, hey. which I've had Kearns? the pleasure of hanging out with these fools in in, in LA. Oh, Show you the most amazing time ever. It. Yeah, and what happens I wasn't going to mention anything specific. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's a secret society. society. You can try to see people right quick. Yeah. Try to sell yourselves out. <laughs> so what's, uh, so man, what's, what's, I see y'all traveling, man, doing shows. What's the, the, the favorite city? What was your favorite city this past year? Damn, this past year. Besides, I mean, besides Salt Lake. Besides Salt Lake. Yeah, besides Salt Lake, yeah. Yeah, because yeah. we was just out here, too. Cause like, yeah. Uh, craziest, I'd say, recently... Tokyo is always crazy Tokyo because it, it feels crazy. like Tokyo Drift, you know, it's like real oh, futuristic man. and it's just a culture shock and then they, they turn up. Uh, Russia, Russia's also interesting. Russia? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, it's like, is it cold? All right, so is it cold out Montreal, there all year round? It's cold as fuck. Well, well, not all year round, but during but when winter. You, when you went, it was you just... gotta wear like a bear skin, like it's crazy. Yeah. Did you have a mink? You wow. have a mink? Yeah, I was rocking a hey, mink. Hey, but like, wow. there's a lot of hot chicks out that, that side of the world, like Romania oh. and like Moldova, like these are like. Oh, I don't even know what y'all talking chicks about. Moldova chicks, we call them Moldovians. 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 And by the way, I hate your Snapchats because your Snapchats are always on some tropical island. Yeah. And so I don't know what's going on with you, but if you could please stop with that for us that don't have the opportunity to go out it's of the country. That's just a backdrop. <laughs> <laughs> Talking Let, me that, yeah. Let me get some of that. Let me get some of that backdrop. Like this right over. here, you know, we just like throw one of those. It's the picture. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> so what else is going on? In, uh, in fact, uh, talking about Snapchat, I saw E Rock Snapchat earlier today. And uh, I don't know if you should shout him out on this or should get him in trouble. He pre uh, pre previewed or premiered some of your new music. Yes. Oh, Tell us about that. Yes. Well, uh, absolutely. Shout out to DJ Erocalypse, man. Uh, we, uh, we, during Soundcheck, we were testing our new song. It's uh, DJ Chronic, who did uh, Bend Over, Make Your Knees oh, Touch yeah. Your Elbows. DJ oh. Chronic, Far East Movement. And this is an OG. We actually met him at Summer Jam. Yeah. What, 2000 and fuck? Uh, excuse me. Long time. We just say cuz. We cuz. Fuck shit, bitch. Fuck it. I don't know what I like. So we met, it was Savage. Okay. Swing, Savage. And like, he's like, he's got, he's like triple platinum out in Australia right now. So we met up with him. We're like, let's do a record. And it's, we tested the record out. It's coming out in like, what, a month? You're talking about Samoan dude, Savage. Yeah, Samoan Savage. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he's, uh, he's based out of New Zealand, New Zealand, but yeah. he's, he's kind of big just in that area. Oh, but yeah. He's killing the EDM world, so. You know what's crazy about that? That, that uh, summer jam that we did was headlined by the game also. It was. That is oh, crazy. crazy. Full circle. Full circle. <laughs> <laughs> we, did, we had low riding. We had low riding. If y'all yeah. don't. Yeah, I don't remember. I feel whiskey, but I say, yeah. Yeah. Oh, man. Can I geek out a little bit and tell you how proud I am of you guys? Because I remember that summer jam. That summer jam, you guys came on, and it was Lowrider. And usually, with artists, artists usually have to act like, you know, we've been here before. But it was so cool, because when you guys came through, you guys were like fans. Oh, hell yeah. Right? And this was long before G6 had dropped. And so then you end up dropping G6, and he was bigger than anybody that we had had on any summer jam. Man. And so, and, and it was crazy, is he, I thought even after that, like, I would bump into you guys, and Kevin Pro, you guys would be like, oh, uh, let my management deal with him. But you guys are the same! How are you guys still the same? Boots? Yeah. 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 yeah, right? Where's he from? I don't know that guy. What's his name? <laughs> so, so how have you have been able to stay so humble after all the success? Um... Man, that, that's a crazy question, because, I don't know, man, we're just normal, man. But Mama's Home Cooking, Yeah. E Iraq e uh feed, feeds us great, you know what so, I mean? When we come out here, it's like chilling with family, it doesn't yeah. feel like anything new, it just Fireball. feels like... It feels Fireball. like Fireball. Fireball. Oh, what about beer pong? Oh, yeah. Lots and lots. oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Can, oh, we, can we house party tonight? Oh, you know what we're doing? We're doing, uh, we're, we're doing something. All I know is you're not passing out, because your flight, you have to catch it what time? Turn up, turn up, eight or nine. Okay. All the way to I even called my wife and let her know. So, <laughs> spe so speaking of family, man, e Rock told me this funny story last time y'all was here, taking your shoes off at the door. Oh, <laughs> man. <laughs> that, that, that's, that's some stereotypical, yeah, you just don't put me on blast for that, but okay, let me explain. Tell me about it. So I go to uh, e Rock Lewis's crib, really clean, nice place. He just walks right in with wifey, boom, walks in right in there. Shoes are on. I'm like, Asian culture is, you gotta take off your shoes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
So I stand, me and our, our tour manager, you know, we're, we were raised Asian, so we're just standing by the door. We won't walk in, our shoes are on, and we're just looking at him and his wife, he walking through <laughs> a nice, like, clean crib, thinking, like, they're not going to take off their shoes. We'll, we'll just wait here until see, we see what happens. And he's like, why are you guys next to this door? Like, oh, oh, do, you, do you want us to take off our shoes? And he was like, he just couldn't stop laughing. He's like, no way, you were waiting by the door the whole time to see if I was going to take off my shoes. And then he started, like, look. I'm in my living room with my shoes <laughs> off, going off on me, you know, because he's he 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 grew up Asian, but you know, at the end of the day, like it, it, it's every household's different, different, you yeah. know what I mean? And so, yeah, that was he wouldn't let me live after that one. Yeah, no, I, I was I was rolling when he told me that yeah, story. Yeah, yeah, that's hilarious. Yeah. So just to make it clear, so we we go to your house, we're taking off shoes. No, I'll look at you weird if you walk in with my sh your shoes okay. on. Okay. Like, okay. He probably got slippers on the I'm side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so, yeah, yeah so, we got to leave on the foot covers ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And rightfully so, because in downtown LA and Koreatown, there's nothing but piss and shit and dog shit all over the streets. So, you know, you don't want to track that in the house. Which, by the way, I never saw any of that. No, uh, I was said there. Piss, yeah. shit, and dog shit, so it's not even just I'm talking dog. human. Oh, like, oh, really? oh yeah. I, I saw nothing like that. Dude, you, you, okay, not you gotta come, come by the crib. I was, I was just telling you. Oh. Oh, oh, me. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> tell, tell, about, tell about the, uh, the beat, beat junkies. The beat Escala. junkies. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh. Escala. Escala. Escala is the dope spot. In yeah. fact, uh, Escala has like the most amazing DJs. We saw so many celebrity, uh, celebrities there. We saw Raz Kaz. He was yeah, eating yeah, out there yeah. when we were out there. And it was dope. It was the dopest food. The beat junkies had their own loco moco. Oh, if you don't know what loco moco is, it's a Hawaiian dish oh. with eggs over uh, ground beef. Uh, oh, gravy. rice, uh, gravy. gravy, oh, it was the most amazing mm -hmm. thing I've ever eaten. Lots of people get so excited when we talk about food. Yeah, yeah. No, and, and, and Koreatown is the best place to be as happy as I was. He's like the mayor of K-Town now. Right? <laughs> I, I want to be. Yeah. I want to go back so bad. <laughs> Certified. Yeah, I want to go to, you know, they have karaoke bars and stuff there. You got to come yeah, this you know. Yeah, I'm down, I'm down. Yeah, that's dope. <laughs> we'll show you some dog meat and all that. I'm just kidding. Oh, hey, <laughs> hey, hey, hey. I'm going to get some food. I'll, I'll eat whatever. Hey, yeah, I'm willing to try anything. Hey, you know, that's right? cool. That's cool. <laughs> cool. Our party smoothie here at U92TO, the Summer Jam. About to go on stage and tear it down. It's U92.